So I listened to Donda 2, not on the stem player, but on my phone, because I'm not paying $200 for a glorified speaker. Now, Donda 2 was actually pretty fucking decent. I surprisingly liked it. It was, like, really good. And, you know, I didn't like the original Donda, and I'm not that big of a fan of Kanye, but holy shit, Donda 2 was actually good. Um... I definitely have my favorite tracks. My favorite tracks, if I had to say, is True Love, Flowers, and City of Gods. Those three were definitely my favorites. And Sci-Fi, maybe. I don't even think there is a song called Sci-Fi, but whatever pirating site I went to, one of the songs is called Sci-Fi. <clears throat> but yeah, this shit was actually really good. I also do have my least favorite songs, like... Broken Road. Easy. The others I liked. <laughs> but yeah. Now, again, I'm using whatever pirating site, so some of the names might be wrong. But still. Donda 2 was pretty fucking decent. I really liked it. Now, would I say it's worth 200 bucks? No. No, that's, that's a waste of money. It's 16 songs. That, that, that's, I think the definition of scam. Yeah, I don't think, like, Kanye's been doing a lot of weird shit recently. And this is just fucking ridiculous. You really want us to pay 200 bucks for this? No, no one, no one's gonna pay two hundred bucks for this. Um, there's already a fucking stem player emulator, and I tried it out. I also tried out the actual stem player's feature of playing stems. I tried sweatpants, and it didn't do that good of a job. But it's still decent enough. You could actually use like the acapellas and instrumentals with that shit. So, would I buy the stem player if the price dropped to like fifty bucks, maybe? But, like, for the full 200 bucks, no. $200, that's too much. I think this should have been, like, $50 max. Because $200 is a little much. But, yeah, I like the stem player. It was, it was a good, it was a, like, I like, yeah, I like the stem player. I like the stem player. I didn't accidentally say stem player. No, I actually legitimately like the stem player. I think it's really cool. Like, being able to play stems of songs. That's... I love that, you know? I don't like the price of it. The biggest issue with Donda 2 is the price. That's the thing that I hate the most. But the stem player's cool. Donda 2's a pretty decent album. Yeah. I really wish this was on streaming services, though. Because this deserves it. And I did make a tweet... That said, like, oh, someone's definitely going to use, like, the arcade hacking shit to, like, get the files off the stem player, you know? And <laughs> the files are on the website. Which, I, I didn't know that. So, you can easily get them if you use the stem player emulator. So, it's not even that much of a task pirating it, pirating, pirating the step, like, the Donda 2. It's surprisingly easy. Slow, but it's easy. But yeah. Yeah. Donda 2 is decent. I like Donda 2. I like the idea of the stem player. I like the price though. And, you know, we can basically get the songs for free easily. Now, I also noticed that there's no real uploads of this album on YouTube. And that's because people's videos are getting blocked for uploading it. Which is a little sad, but, you know. Kanye West didn't sell something that's 200 bucks just for it to immediately get uploaded to the YouTube. So I understand that. But yeah. Donda 2 was interesting. Donda 2 was pretty good. Stem player was pretty good. Yeah. Like I, like I said, it's the price that I don't like. But yeah. Would I recommend the album? Yes. Yes, I would actually recommend it. It's... Decent enough. It has its good fucking songs. 
Now, would I say go buy the album? I mean, if you have $200 to throw away, go ahead. <laughs> but if you don't, just pirate the album. It's easier. Just get that stem player emulator, you know? It's way easier. But yeah. That, that's my review on Donda 2. It, it, good album. It's a good album. Fucking, I'll give this shit 7 out of 10.